Hi there. We're doing a little fun demonstration today with Ardex X77. What I'm going to do is show you guys how sag resistant this thin set is when installing on a, a vertical substrate. Uh, what we've done is we've mixed up our X77 already. Now, if you've looked at the bag, there's two different uh, water mixing ratios. There's a high water mixing ratio and a low water mixing ratio. We've gone to the low mixing ratio on this one just because we are doing that vertical application and we are just showing off how uh, little this tile is going to sag once I put it on the wall. So first what I'm going to do is just give this wall a flat coat. And now I'm going to notch the substrate. With this X77, it's best to do your notches in a vertical line. That way when you install the tile, you can really see how it's not going to move. Alright, what I have here is a square porcelain tile. I believe this is a 20 inch by 20 inch. I'm just going to give the back of this a little uh, back butter. Alright. I'm just giving a little push side to side so it helps collapse those ridges. And as you can see, with one tile, that one's not going anywhere. But we're not done yet. What I'm doing here is just a little scribe line to show you how this tile is not moving. So next up, I have another porcelain tile, and I'm just going to add some weight to existing tile. Again, this is just demonstration purposes, just to show you the added weight and how it's not going to set. That's one. We're not done yet. Two tiles on top of an extra tile. Still has not moved. And just for fun, we're going to add one more tile. That's the magic of X77. So it's not every day we get to come back and rip our demonstration tiles off. I installed these tiles two days ago with Ardex X77, just giving a little demonstration on how great the sag resistance is with that uh, product. I had a tile on top of a tile on top of another tile. So what I'm going to do is just take this apart and yeah, just get a rough idea of how well it's stuck. That's stuck pretty good. Uh, full contact, you can see there's no trowel lines. Um, and that was just Ardex X77 tiled to another tile. No primer, nothing.
you can see, that's on there quite well. That one's on there pretty good. You know, this is just a tile on top of another tile. No primer. Uh, you can see that thin set is still curing underneath. Um, it's porcelain to porcelain, so it's going to take quite a while for it to dry. But that stuck quite well. Good coverage. And then now this last tile was installed on top of a uh, backer board. The brand name is a uh, Weedy. So I'm just going to see on how well that stuck. I have a pretty good feeling this is going to pull the board off the wall. What I really want to do is separate these two so you can get a really good visual of, uh, of what's behind this tile. As you can see, I'm having quite a hard time doing that. Okay, wow, that's pretty good. So our inset pulled the face of the weedy off the board. Um, and even that tile it didn't have 100% contact behind it. Um, but you can see how that just pulled it right off that backer board. Which is pretty cool when you're thinking about which backer board to use uh, in any of your tile installations. You can see um, some perform a lot better than others. Um, this one performed great. Um, I did a demonstration with a different brand. Uh, didn't perform as good. So yeah, it's uh, pretty interesting to see. The power of Artex 77.